When you're customizing items for use with the Project Navigator in AutoCAD MEP, don't overlook the sheet template and its title block. You can leverage project properties and sheet set properties and have these items filled out automatically when adding to the project. Start by opening the Project Sheets template located in the Project's Resource Directory. From the Layout tab, select the Arch F tab. Zoom in, then review the title block, which already has fields defined. Double click on the gray field for the project number. This will open the mText editor. Right click on the field and choose Edit Field. The field dialog will open. This data is associated with the project number. Since this is an overall project setting, if you change this value in Project Properties, it will edit the value in all sheets. Note the formatting is set to uppercase. This ensures that no matter how the information is typed into the property, the text will always be uppercase. Select OK to close the field dialog and then OK to close the mText editor. Repeat these steps for the sheet number. When you get to the fields dialog, notice that this value comes from the sheet set. So you would have to go to the Sheets tab and right click on the sheet file to edit the source data. Cancel from this dialog and pick OK to exit. Let's add a field for the Approved By Sheet Custom property. Pick the title block, right click, and select Edit Block in Place. Select OK at the Reference Edit dialog. Once you're in the block, change the text from Copyright to Approved By. Double click on the text and use the DD Edit command to make this change. Press Enter twice when finished. Next, we'll add another piece of text, which can be converted to a field. Better yet, let's cheat. Pick the Checked By text and copy it down to the Approved By line. Edit the M text. Then edit the field. You'll see that this is a Current Sheet Custom field. Set the format to uppercase and then type in the name Approved By. Pick OK to exit the dialog, then OK again to exit the mText editor. To check this, go to the Sheets tab. Right-click on the Project Sheet Set and then choose Properties. Notice how the Approved By field that we just created doesn't appear, so we need to add it. Select Edit Custom Properties at the bottom of the dialog. Click Add, name it Approved By, making sure you name the field exactly the same. Place a couple of X's for the default value. Make sure you pick Sheet as the owner so it belongs to the Sheet Custom Properties. Select OK, and then select OK again to save the changes. Select OK to exit the Sheet Set properties. And that's all there is to it. Take the time to review the information you want to appear in your sheets. Create fields with mText entities to show the data and associate it with the right field. And don't forget to check the project and Sheet Set properties to include the fields and you can have this work for you.